Hey there, it's Katrina Sawa here, the Jumpstart Your Biz Coach with jumpstartyourmarketing.com. And I have a quick business video tip for you today. I want to talk about technology a little bit. <clears throat> you see, probably one of the biggest questions I get asked is, which technology do I need to use to make my business more effective, systematized, automated, and profitable? Right? And actually, people don't ask that question. What I find is that when I first talk to an entrepreneur and for the first time, whether they're new in business or they've been in business or you've, you know, you've been in business for years, um, the, the topic of technology comes up because I need to know when I, in order to advise you on things that you're doing to grow your business and get more business and get more clients and make more money, I need to know how you're running the business, right? So I look at everything you're doing from the top to the bottom, this right to the left, to the big picture down to the nitty gritty of all the little things that you have uh, invested in, you're paying on monthly uh, tools and, and software and things like that. And so what I uncover usually is that a lot of people are in, using the wrong technology for your needs. And I, when I say wrong, I mean wrong for you. So I don't like to just come on and say, okay, everybody needs to use X service or software because that doesn't apply to everybody. Um, when you go to an event sometimes and there's 400 people in the room and the person on stage will say, every one of you needs this thing, this one tool or this one software, or you need to use this to run your business or this is a CRM or this to take credit cards or this to run your email marketing. I don't do that. And I don't do that for a reason because there's so many different price points on all this technology that I, I don't want someone who's not ready for a certain technology to get into that in a monthly payment or whatnot when they're not ready for it or if they're only selling a few things. So one of the biggest questions I ask, and you can look at this for yourself and kind of evaluate if you're in the right software or not is what are you selling, <clears throat> right? If you're a coach or an author, speaker, you might be selling, number one, you might be selling a book, right? Like I have some books here. You might be selling a book. You might be selling a three-day event or even a one-day workshop, right? You might be selling a webinar. You might be selling a coaching program, whether it's live or virtual, one-on-one -on -one or in a group program. You wanna get people either to pay up front or in a recurring payment right? And a monthly payment. You may have a membership program. You may have a way for people to buy you one-on-one, -on -one, right? Whether it's a, a monthly, pro, monthly payment for one-on-one -on -one coaching or consulting or, um, you know, one-time fee for a one-time call, something like that. Those are some ideas that you might be selling. Now, there's a whole bunch of other things you could be selling, but even with that, those types of things, eBooks, audios, and any of the do-it-yourselfs, if you're selling any of those things that I just mentioned, okay, uh, if you're in the first year of your business and you don't yet have the perfect website with all the different bells and whistles and every opt-in boxes and autoresponders and funnels and lead pages and all that, if you don't all have that already yet, it's okay. Don't freak out. You can take payments on PayPal, okay? Now you can, I don't, I don't suggest that as a long-term strategy because I think to be in business these days, you have to embrace some of the other technologies and systems through shopping carts and things like that. <clears throat> but it is a great way to start taking money today to get paid on your services or product, products, programs, or events, okay? And you can do it right on web, uh, your WordPress website. Please have a WordPress website, not a GoDaddy template or a Wix or Weebly or something like that. If you need to start your business with those templates, that's fine, but make a goal to actually move out of them into a, um, a user-friendly WordPress theme and get help to build it. Don't try to build those yourself because that is not a good plan. It will look like you built your website yourself. Now, I know some of these templates look really nice and actually sites that are built like that look really nice, but they're not usually the funct functional enough. You don't usually have all the different functionality and click to buy and sign up forms and all these different things that are gonna make your business a smooth running money making machine. So that's one of the reasons. It's not because you don't know what you're doing in template design. Um, I get that some of you do. 
you still don't know what you don't know about having everything run as a smooth running system. Who wants a smooth running system? I know I do. It helped me when I had two total hip replacement surgeries in one year. It helped me when my husband, uh, then my fiance, went through cancer and I had to go to chemo appointments with him every single day of the week for like eight weeks, okay, and I can only work half the time. So systems and that technology and those forms and opt-in boxes and automated marketing and autoresponders are a must moving forward in your business. I don't really care what you're selling, but if you need to reach a lot more people in order to make a lot more impact and or a lot more sales, you need to have these systems in place. <clears throat> and again, there's so much to tell you, I can't even go into it on this video. I just want you to be aware that you want to look at what you're selling. And um, even if you don't have anything to sell yet, sometimes people will come to me and they'll say, well, I don't have any of that yet, Katrina. Well, you can sell yourself today, right? You can sell an hour of your time. You can sell a monthly whatever of yourself. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Just put a price tag on it and offer it to somebody and you can take money. Okay, now you have to take a credit card these days. Now, PayPal is, is good for a little while, like I said, but it's not the best solution long term, okay? There's a shopping cart. There's all kinds of ones like Infusionsoft and ClickFunnels and Kajabi and um, Entreport. Those are the bigger ones with, no, ClickFunnels is not really a shopping cart, but Infusionsoft, Kajabi, and Entreport <coughs> are the ones that are really great if you're making over $100,000 a year already and you can afford a team to help you manage it and do things in the cart and in the back end of the system and you can afford the team up to maybe $500 to $1,000 a month. If you can't afford that and you're not making at least um, $100,000 or enough to, to invest in that kind of stuff, don't go there. Why would you go there? Don't go there. I run across it all the time where coaches and, and gurus at the on stage are trying to get people like you and, and first time business owners to invest in those kinds of software. And I tell them themselves, I just ran across the infusion guy and I, at a conference and I love infusion, uh, well, I did not love infusion software my business, but I know that it's a capable system. Most people I know though that get into it don't set it up, they don't take the time to either learn it or delegate the stuff that needs to get set up to make it the the really cool system that it is. So therefore, you only use it for the basic stuff, which why would you pay for a high end when you can pay for a, a basic cart <laughs> and just do the basics? Because I, I was in there for two years and I didn't even set up all the stuff that I needed to do and I knew what I needed to do and I knew what I needed to write, but I couldn't I didn't take the time to do it myself or delegate it in two years. So just be realistic with what you're you're getting yourself into is my, my opinion. Um, I'm not saying they're bad, but they are for a certain level of person in business that can afford support around that, in my opinion. Uh, the things like just email marketing, right? There's Constant Contact, MailChimp, there's GetResponse, uh, ActiveCampaign, Aweber, a lot of tools like that that are majority just email autoresponders and email broadcast systems and then they all also have CRM capabilities, right? So those are the kinds of software that you want if you're not really using a shopping cart. Um, maybe you're a network marketing business or something and people buy off the parent company website but you need a place to nurture your list and keep your list of people. Those are great systems for you. And they're on all different price points, frankly. Um, and you got to watch out for some of those, though, because they will increase the price as you increase the number of subscribers. I don't really like systems like that, personally. I think it's deceiving. People don't know what they're getting into, and they don't realize that when they hit 500 or 1,000 subscribers, then their rate's going to go up every month. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that strategy. So, um, so make sure you look for things like that. <clears throat> and... You can certainly use some of those email systems along with PayPal if you're going to take money, but it's just not the best long-term solution in my opinion if you want a smooth running system and, you want, and you're not that techie and you really only want to log into one place to manage your business. Besides your WordPress website, there's one place you can go, uh, which you know the shopping cart that I use is the the one that I used a long time ago when I first started doing this and everybody was using it. All the coaches were using the one that I'm using now, 
But then they got all like swayed away by uh, softwares, the, the ones I mentioned earlier. So I actually tried all those other ones out and then came back to this one. And I lost a bunch of subscribers in the process, frankly, because of the... Well, there's a whole bunch of reasons, but I lost subscribers because of the bad communication and email links and all this kind of stuff. So, anywho, <sighs> I know sometimes this software stuff is really confusing. I don't want it to be confusing for you. I want to simplify it. That's my goal with any client is to help you simplify the way that you're running your business because you need to be out there marketing and talking to more people. You can't spend all your time in the back end worrying about these systems and the technology and going to training courses on it all, frankly, that's just ridiculous, right? So we need something that's simple, easy to learn, and it will fit in the type of business that you have and the things that you're selling. And oh, what I was gonna mention earlier is someone. sometimes people come to me and they say, well, I'm not selling any of that, Katrina. I don't need PayPal or I don't need a shopping cart. And I say, okay, so in six months, what would you like to be selling? Oh, I'm gonna sell eBooks and books and I'm gonna have a coaching program. Well, why would you want to get into a system right now that doesn't allow you to take credit cards and really manage your business well, like MailChimp or something? And then in six months, change change databases? No, that's a nightmare. That's like, trust me, I've moved from many different databases and I've lost subscribers in the process. I don't recommend that. So if you really think, if you know you're gonna sell some stuff within the next few months, I mean, it's your own monkey mind and your confidence level that's holding you back from selling it right now, frankly. <laughs> so get rid of that and sell it today, okay? Uh, instead of three months from now when I figure out what I'm doing, no, just sell something that makes sense today uh, and get the right system in place for yourself and something simple and let me show you how. I know how to do a lot of the back end stuff and I like to show my clients exactly what you need to know and not what you don't need to know. Okay, so I show you just enough to do the things that you need to do as an entrepreneur. I wanna empower you to understand a little bit about your technology and show you a little bit about what you need to do. And don't get me wrong, I highly believe in delegating this to an assistant or a techie VA, but you do have to understand as the entrepreneur how it all flows and runs together and how it supports your business and your marketing strategies. So a little bit of training is super smart, and I have tutorials for that. I do that on screen share, on Zoom, and things like that all the time with clients. And sometimes it just takes an hour or two to show you. So I don't want you to be scared of what you need to know. If you really want an honest opinion of what you need for your business and your goals and what you need to make and what you need to sell, on the technology side, I really want to have a call with you because I don't want you to get sucked into some other scam or, or expensive thing that you don't need. I'm all about the realistic, let's build your business the most affordable, affordable way possible with the easiest systems for you that will be functional and get you where you wanna go. So I'm happy to chat with you. I have some time uh, in the next three weeks to book a couple calls. If you're interested in that, please go to askcat.biz. It's A-S-K. K-A-T dot B-I-Z. Now, I do have an event coming up next week, so I'm a little little busy this week, but you have to, you want to get in and fill out the questions on that page now so that you can get in earlier. If you wait two weeks till you think I'm free, I'm going to be booked up again. Okay, so don't wait. If you want some help, I'm happy to advise you on this, talk to you more about your business and all that, and really set you straight so you don't waste money in the wrong places, okay? Um, it's, I'm really passionate about this. I'm really passionate about entrepreneurs making more money doing what you love and the most affordable way possible of doing that. And I promise you, I will not steer you wrong. If you come to a call with me, um, you'll probably save thousands of dollars. <laughs> so I look forward to it. If you can even attend an event, I do happen to have an event coming up in December. It's a one day event. So if you're local to Northern California, it'll be really convenient for you. If not, you're welcome to still come out and travel for it. But it's a one day technology training. 
So it's, you bring your laptop and we actually sit in the room and I walk around and it's about 10 to 20 people max is all I'm taking. It's a couple hundred bucks people. And, but it's like, it's like hands on technology training. We can look at your website, your shopping carts, your email marketing systems, your social media, your YouTube, your videos, anything technology that you don't understand that you want to get a handle on. I will show you how to do it in person in that room myself, okay? And I'll probably even give a follow-up call to people who attend that event. So you can go to livebigevents.com, livebigevents.com. It's the December event, and then I'm gonna have some more in 2019 as well if you can't make that date. Um, but don't wait to get a handle on the technology because it really does free up a lot of your time, saves you a lot of time, and it helps you reach a lot more people faster and make more money. So don't wait. Get help now, okay? Talk to you later. Have a good day, all.